Hey, what's up? With me over here is the Logitech MK540 and it's the MT10 and the K540, so they're in one combo and we're gonna check if they're worth it. So I will be giving away something in the next video. So just have three people subscribe to this channel because I can check on YouTube studio and comment down below uh, their names and you've entered. So starting with the keyboard, this keyboard is a membrane keyboard and it's normally used for typing, let's say uh, on your business, it doesn't make that much noise. So uh, it's not that clicky. Because, you know, if you get the uh, mechanical, sometimes uh, they're normally clicky. So, yeah, this one is just for the office and doing your work, editing. I did not recommend it for gaming, but the keys are bouncy, so you can work with it for gaming. And it's compatibility, um, it's compatible with Windows and Chromebook. And this is Mac, but we remarked it, so... It works really well actually and yeah so this keyboard has stands and stands where, where you can adjust them because um it has stands for four degrees and eight degrees so you can adjust the height and actually have your comfort because uh it's yours and yeah it really has uh it has a matte gray finish on top and uh it has white on the bottom so uh its design is okay but it's just it's not that flashy doesn't have that many colors but uh it's okay it does the work oh uh, yeah that's pretty much it for the keyboard uh it's really clicky and uh it gets 36 months of battery life so basically you just use uh two double a alkaline batteries and yeah it also has a port on the back for the uh, nano chip and fun facts the nano chip uh actually works like both of the devices put together and it works on what one, one chip so one nano chip so yeah it's really great so right on the mouse the mouse is the m310 and it has the same design not that flashy and yeah it has three buttons the left right and of course the scroll and yeah the scroll is really smooth and uh, the mouse actually has a uh, rubber grip on the side, so it's, um, it's an ambidextrous design and it can work both with the right and left hand, so yeah, you don't need to worry about uh, if you're a right hand, if you use right hand or left hand. It doesn't have any buttons, so you're safe. And yeah, so that's the mouse. It runs up to 1000 dpi and basically dpi works on the speed, not accuracy, so really great but you can control it on your pc anyway and yeah so that's pretty much it for the mouse and the keyboard it's not a really long one but yeah there you have it so if you're going for this keyboard it's actually under 60 dollars it's actually under 50 i'd see it's 48 dollars right now so if you want to shop it right now just go for it but um, if you live in another country, maybe on buying it on Amazon, well, uh, you'll have to pay extra shipping money. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this keyboard and mouse. Thank you for watching this one, and yeah, we'll start in the next one.